What's going on YouTube? Max back here with another video. We're just going to be going over a few more updates that I've done to the DC-5 since the uh, last past uh, update video. So, alright, let's get into this. Alright, so as you can see, some things have changed. I've gotten the RBC intake manifold. I got it for $200. It was already cut. Great deal I found on the Facebook Marketplace. Also, I got the new k-tune fuel rail i also snagged that for a good deal hundred dollars for that and then i just went ahead and picked up the gauge for the uh fuel pressure but anyway as you can see i have also cleaned up the cruise control line i got completely rid of that and i also deleted the module which is behind this panel back there which you can't see um so basically oh yeah i also got the uh radiator hose there which you need and the adapter plates here which you also need to get the RBC to work um I tossed my heat blanket or whatever you want to call that for the turbo going on back there as so you can see the downpipe's cool looking blue right now um there's a few other things I still need to tidy up as I ordered a catch can so if I'm not too sure I'm thinking about mounting it over there not too sure yet um, I do have a new belt as you can see this one's getting pretty worn and shot So yeah Also, as you can see I've just tidied up some of these small little lines I mean, it's not the cleanest looking but I tried to shorten them up as much as possible same here um, Also shorten up this little line over here. Just trying to get it looking a little bit nicer I'm probably gonna end up getting a new filter as that is my old filter from the cold air intake I had when I was all motor um, other than that, it's pretty much all I've done since the last update. Uh, yeah, so basically I just have to install that new fuel pump and that new belt. And I should be ready for the tune. I'm probably going to wait till the spring to get a real tune. Probably going to head up to Kinetic Auto Works. That's really nice local shop. They do really good work. But also guys, I did take my intake off the other day and check the shaft play on the turbo back there. And there is almost zero shaft play, which I mean, when you get the, the turbo brand new, there is a little bit. So it's still the same as when it was brand new. So very happy about that. I've done about a thousand miles boosting a little here and there on the uh, street map I did put on myself. So um, if you do like the build or have any questions, leave them down below. Subscribe for more and uh, catch you in the next one, guys. See ya.